Good day to you, uh, I am the Gentleman Observer. Or in this case, uh, ladies and gentlemen, not the Gentleman Observer. For you'll see, today I must uh, regretfully speak to you on the subject of two uh, what can only be determined as reprehensible binders who uh, saw fit, shall we say, to air themselves upon national television this morning uh, in a most improper manner. Now, I, I uh, of course am more than aware of the sartorial disregard of the modern society with such as the blatherskite bumbling politician bureaucrats going about the place with their shirts loose and in some cases uh, perish the thought not even wearing a tie. But ladies and gentlemen, the situation facing us uh, today and indeed uh, yesterday is one of far greater levity. You'll see, for it um, uh, seems, shall we say, that uh, not only was the gentleman chef yesterday uh, appearing uh, in his, shall we say, natural self, but also today one of the uh, further members of the show in question, of which I'm sure you know which I speak, um, also decided he would attempt to trump the uh, gentleman cook's antics by uh, repeating the gesture himself. Now, of course, I speak of the uh, shocking, shall we say, appearance of the two chaps without any form of uh, clothing about their person. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I would wish to state in the first instance that I am quite thoroughly disgusted by this course of action on the part of both of these two irresponsible uh, men, shall I say. Um, I understand that one of the hosts of the show said, Oh, jolly good, I think we're going to get away with that. Get away with it? I tell you one thing, you'll never get away with it as long as self-respecting gentlemen walk the face of the earth, and I am quite sure, I can tell you quite confidently, that self-respecting gentlemen still do walk the face of the earth. Indeed, as long as I walk the face of the earth, I know there'll be at least one, but I have no intention to blow my own time at the door. I have no doubt there are many other self-respecting gentlemen out there. But of course, as I'm sure all of us uh, in that particular league, uh, league can agree, uh, the gentleman host in this case certainly shall not be getting away with any form of such thing as long as we have anything to say. And of course, it is most thoroughly shocking and sadly, I should say, disappointing, uh, disheartening that one should have to watch not only sartorial disregard, but now it seems sartorial abandon entirely in this uh, cash, boorish and knavish fashion. Uh, the sorts of antics that uh, one would expect, perhaps, from, you know, uh, sort of, well, I, 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 I dread to think the sort of show one might uh, have to reasonably uh, consult in order to see this sort of outlandish behaviour. In summary, ladies and gentlemen, I believe the antics of the two uh, uh, binders in this case should be roundly condemned. Uh, the two chaps should be given a uh, jolly good proverbial horse whipping and told exactly what's what and warned harshly never to repeat the same disgusting course of action that, that they took on the uh, productions of this morning and yesterday morning. I thank you all most kindly for listening to my uh, views on this matter, which I feel most strongly about, uh, not being at all uh, predisposed to such shows of uh, base shame uh, without any apparent guilt, uh, all in the name of good entertainment, it seems, which is really rather more disgusting to one's person, I must say. Well, uh, still, uh, one, shall, one can but continue to point out these things and uh, hope that those who view will nod their heads in agreement or, or as the case may be, hurl tomatoes if they feel I'm quite off in this area. But regardless, I thank you all most kindly for watching uh, once more and will invite you all to leave any comments uh, if you so wish or indeed to subscribe. Uh, most welcomed uh, and, and appreciated entirely. Um, I am the Gentleman Observer and I very much hope I shall see you again on another episode uh, of this particular publication here on YouTube. Uh, until then.